the Mahdi is Eastern but like the Romans. This is the manuscript I'm, I'm bringing for you today. So God bless you everyone. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wa barakatuh. So as I said in this video I'm providing for you a, a precious and very very important manuscript actually this manuscript is is written by a scholar named al hafiz al sakhawi uh, excuse me not not al hafiz his name is abdul abdul wahab ibn umar al husayni al dimashqi al shafii this scholar actually is believed to to be or he was dead in the year 875 after Hijra and he has a, a very long manuscript and his manuscript is actually preserved in uh, the state library the German state library in the capital Berlin and then the number 1698 and it is in a library there out there in Germany and it's very very precious one of its pages is entitled entitled the Mahdi is Eastern but like the Romans I didn't really read the whole manuscript so I don't know if it's it's all about the apocalypse and the end times but it is very very important to take a look at and to get info information and wisdom from it so I translated it and the manuscript reads as follows the Mahdi peace be upon him will have a shining face his features will be wonderful and he will have a mind not like the minds of, of humans because he will act on divine inspi inspiration as the righteous servant in the Surah of Al-Kahf and as the righteous mother in the Surah of Maryam and as Allah inspired the mother of Moses nurse him but when you fear for him, when you fear for him put him then into the river and do not fear or grieve the Mahdi will fear nothing but Allah he will be empowered by Allah over kings and kingdoms and he will conquer a land beneath it which is a land and the people of the two great seas will kneel be before him and Allah will afflict them with an affliction from the sky and the sea and with affliction from under the earth and and they find no relief except by submitting to the king of the Muslims the strong and frightening man of unrelenting might and through the Mahdi, Allah will honor the oppressed, exalt religion, and spread justice. And in the time of the Mahdi, the secrets of the Holy Quran will be revealed as a clear argument. And whoever seeks a way other than Islam, he will be among the, lures, the losers. It is a wisdom that no one of the worlds knew except for the, the one whom Allah sent as a mercy to the worlds. The Mahdi will be an example of Allah casting love for his prophet Moses into the hearts of, of people. As Allah says, and I blessed you with lovability from me. Allah will cast love into the hearts of all the people of the earth for the Mahdi, except for one who has a disease in his heart or who considers himself an enemy of Allah. And the Mahdi will be an Arab from the people of the Qibla but he will have the roman beauty on his face and look as it was narrated that the mahdi would prefer the roman clothes the mahdi will wear a special uniform for each session and occasion he will be well dressed and beautiful in, in appearance allah loves him because allah is beautiful and he loves beauty the mahdi will rule with justice and distribute wealth with equity and he will be loved by the Roman youth, who will be the majority of the population of the earth. 
as the Prophet Muhammad. May Allah bless him and grant him peace, prophesied. Allah will cast into the Romans the love and light of the Mahdi that will reach the four corners of the earth. There will be no glory except for those who will follow the master of the children of Adam, the one whom Allah sent, has chosen as a prophet and messenger, and with whom he sealed the prophecy. May Allah's praise and peace be upon him, and for whoever will follow his guardian, the Mahdi, whose, astronomy, whose astronomical, astronomical round will bring great destruction upon the enemies of Allah. Blessed is he who joins the party of Allah. The party of Allah is the picture. The Mahdi will burn the enemies of Allah with fire and terrorize them with the sun in the days of the great calamity when the unseen world will prevail over the seen one and the Romans will hope for the justice and food of the Mahdi in the days of Allah's wrath. It is narrated that the men of the family of the Prophet peace and blessings be upon them, will have a great throne with lights rich in the clouds and the sky, placed for him in the land of the night journey. And from it will come the call of every time from a single face that has a thousand, that has a thousand thongs, tongues, which even the inhabitants of the mountains and those who live among the beasts in the dense trees could hear. And every human being will see him as he as as if he were before everyone with his color, voice and appearance at the time of his speech. It is as if he will be a shadow and as if he will be looking from mirror to mirror. The enemies of Allah will not be in the Holy Land because the Mahdi will finish them with the sword, except for those who hide or seek safety through covenant with the Mahdi. And the Mahdi will ascend to heaven from the land of the night journey. He will not ascend in body and soul to heaven. And what the master of the prophets has seen will not be revealed to him. But he will attain so much light and God and guidance. And all creation and the Lord of the earth and the sky will help the Mahdi in every war he will fight. And in the noble sanctuary, the Mahdi will sit on his throne with deep sorrow over the treachery of the semi man in the time of the, the, the Dajjal, who will hide and not come out except when the star of the Mahdi will appear in the sky and the end of the affliction come, and the Torah of Moses will appear in the coffin of the Quran, and the Jews will be defeated after their arrogance, after which there will be no arrogance for them until the day of the judgment. The Mahdi will die of pure blood shed by the dark injustice and the accursed Satan. He alone by the command of heavens knows how, how such a destiny would be, because it is a matter of wonder that will bring the anger of the alliances of the Jews who will treachery the Mahdi and break their peace treaty with him. Then what the prophets of prophets Muhammad, may Allah bless him and his family and grant them peace prophesied will come true. It will be a battle the likes of which the children of Adam have never seen before, and there has, has never been anything like it in this world, because blood will fill the reefs as if they were torrents of water, and Allah will command all his creation to turn into soldiers to, to aid the cause of his servant who aids Allah. So this was the full manuscript. I hope you enjoyed this manuscript and it is very very precious because I think nobody really knows this thing about the Mahdi that he will have a Roman beauty and will wear Roman clothes and will have Roman features. Most of the people think that the Mahdi is an Arab and he will be so similar to Saudis, the Arabian Saudis in the kingdom. Saudi kingdom so the image of the Mahdi for them is this way like an Arab man with something on his head you know like the Arabs and but this manuscript manuscript really changed my my imagination about the Mahdi so 
it's very very important to to know about this manuscript so thank you for watching and meet you in another video stay tuned i'll bring more and more information and manuscripts so thank you for watching